so. But, dude, I know what it's like out there. Being by yourself and getting beaten down by coach and his little lackeys. But, just know, man, I'm glad you're here. And in case you need anything, I got your pack, man. All right. I'll be ready for my match. Good luck on your match right there. <laughs> you see, I, I understand I may not be everybody's cup of tea around here, but that's all fine at you and Danny, baby, because I am still, I am still the battleweight campion. Doesn't matter whether you like me, whether you hate me, whether you love me, whether you adore me, I am still a fighting champion. You know what? I am Battle Club X's fighting champion. I'm Battle Club fighting champion. I am here every single time there's an X. I am here. You know why I just defended this? I feel like defending it again, baby. So to anyone, everyone, come on, come on, step right up, and welcome to the great. And this is the second half of season two, Battle Club X. Oh yeah. Episode 13. What a better way to start off than a title match for the Battle right. Weight Championship. Yes. This one about yours, In one of our final episodes, Jocko won it in a surprise, in a surprise impromptu match versus Prince Ahmed. And here we go. Mr. Opportunity. Talk about an opportunity. Dante Valentine will go against the greatest damn showman, Jocko, our new battle weight champion. And I, I think we can both agree, this is Dante's career match. I think so. I think so. He's had opportunities with some pretty stellar opponents, but if he can pull this championship win off, I mean, it would be the biggest upset, but definitely the biggest win for sure. And if there's three no, waist lock takedowns. Oh See, this is what the battle weight championship and division is all about. Top notch competition. Style, what, stylistic differences. Oh my God. Go Dante, look at him go. Woo. Big arm drag. Drop kick to the midsection. Dante's fired up. <clears throat> he ducks under the clothesline. Uh oh. No way. Oh, 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 what? Oh, 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 what is this? Oh, go, 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 cover. Oh, I wow. That was close. That was a counter to that fireman's takeover attempt. Beautiful. Another drop kick. Dante Valentine's fired up. Jocko's gathering himself. Oh, wait a minute. Is he going to fly? Is Dante going to fly? Oh! oh! Cut off with a knee right to the jaw. The only thing flying are the stars on his head right now. Yeah, he, he's definitely woozy right now. He has to compose himself quick. You do not want to be in this position against Jocko. Jocko seems to have reignited that feud with Brian Baum at Jobber Slam 4, be, both being part of that Jobber Slam Battle Royal for a championship shot, showing you where Jocko's mind is. He's already a champion. Right. Could we potentially see Brian Baum against Jocko in the future right. for the Battleweight Championship? Right. That'll be a match. That would definitely be a match. Jocko. Oh, oh my God! My God! <laughs> that chop was so loud, Brian Baum heard it. <laughs> that was a... Oh, oh, he broke his heart indeed with that one. Oh, my God! Oh, my God. What? Jocko has definitely found some reinvigoration, becoming the Battleweight Champion. Oh, oh he ducks under. What? Oh, my God! Woo! Dante Valentine with a bad jump on top of his own! Jesus Christ! Oh, a jab. Oh, oh God. <laughs> None of these guys are playing around. This has become a competition of Seriously. chops. He's licking his palm. Oh, my gosh. They both duck no under way. a set of chops. Oh, he cuts them off with a kick to the midsection. 
Oh, pushed him off, but he rebounds off the ropes. Oh. oh, met with a big elbow, big back elbow there by Jocko. Oh, oh. Jesus Christ! Oh. Beautiful counter there by Jocko. I was gonna say before that little exchange, Steve Pena's panties are wet somewhere <laughs> with all those series of chops. Right now, Dante Valentine has to focus on getting back on track. You do not want Jocko dominating in the match. You de definitely don't. A stiff right hand to the back of the head of Dante Valentine. Oh, wow. The thud on that Euro. No way. Oh, my God. Measured, and that snap headbutt. Another one. A couple. And another. Oh, oh man, goodness. he spiked Three. himself. What? The, I've never seen anything like that. He spiked himself onto his opponent. Sometimes, here we go. Sometimes you have to injure yourself to inflict yeah. double the pain. And did you notice, he took that left hand and he forced his face down to try to get secure that pin. If he had that leg, he might have gotten a three. What a psychopath. Oh, oh my man. God. Encouraging him. Oh, my him. goodness. Oh, what? What? That's how you said earlier, Joe. Somewhere out there, Steve Pena is scratching his yeah, ears. Yeah, like, I'm, I hit his, his, his. His wrestling sense is tingling. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if you've noticed, the middle rope is in baby blue. That is in honor of We Love Wrestling's Trey D, who we tragically lost earlier in this year. Um, we're obviously going to honor him as much as possible. Jocko showing that battle weight oh style. Backflips out, but eats a clothesline. Oh, and another. Dante Valentine, he's throwing that arm. He's fired up. Can we see an upset, Joe? It would suck if Jocko lost his first title defense. Big oh time God. jumping. Oh, he landed on his head. What the hell? I can't. Can the kid do it? Can Mr. Opportunity seize the day? Here we go. There's Beautiful that splash. pump splash. Oh, fly cross body. Not, it got your one, two. Oh my God! That crossbody elevated referee Yardley Black off his feet. Only a counter two. Wow! What a match! This is what a championship opportunity does to a man. The crowd is firmly behind Dante Valentine. Oh! Oh, oh, a roaring forearm! Dante Valentine, this is probably the best I've ever seen him perform. And, and honestly, it's the best shape he's ever been in. Look at that kid. When he joined the fallout shelter, he wasn't much bigger than you. This is hunger for opportunities, hunger to make it in this business. Referee Yardley Black reminding them the, the match can't be won out there. Oh, oh my God! Jocko tried to speed in, ended up eating. Oh, oh, oh there's that basement seven one eight. What a move! Oh, step up, Enzi! He told him to do something, it, and he did. That, that left <laughs> arm is twitching. Come on, it, it, kid. Oh. Uh-oh. What gonna, are we going to see here? What's he looking for? Is he looking for that snap fireman driver? Yes, oh he God. is. He's got him up. Oh. Oh. Did you see he cur he curled that arm to hold it? Oh, he got him back in position. That oh. shape he's been in, man. Oh, here we go. side show effect. Jesus Christ. Oh, he rolled him over. What's this going to be? What? Oh, he's got a full Nelson. He's got a full Nelson and a clutch on. That's it. Hey, that's it. That's it. That's it. What? What a match. The winner of your match and still battleweight champion, the greatest damn showman, Chiaco.
Jocko successful in his first title defense, but damn, Dante what Valentine gave him everything he had. I am going to be the prophet of tonight and say, Dante Valentine is a future battleweight champion. I, I don't disagree, because that was a hell of a fight he gave him. But for now, still, your battleweight champion, Jocko.